Hey guys, so we're back again today because Hey my mom. It's not why we're here. But it just so happened to happen. Um Foxy Charm came in for this month. What's crazy is that hold on, let me get some scissors. So Foxy Charm sends you a shipping email and then also an email being like, oh like what are you getting? And they show you like I think three of the five items and they let two be a mystery but most of the time I don't get that email till after my boxy charm gets here which I always think is really funny because it's like I already know you don't even need to send it to me now I already know what I got but I always just think it's funny so Charm breaking the ice. That's the theme this month. I'm not gonna look at the back because that'll tell me what I got. What's this? Oh, we got a mana Kedar Beauty Simplified Lipstick Lip Whip in Faith. Excuse me, son. Can you not go dark right now? Lipstick. Okay, it's the color. I was really confused by this packaging. This packaging is interesting. I mean, it's a pretty color. I just want to open it all the way because I don't know yet if I'm gonna keep that. We'll see. Hmm. Next, we have a Skin and Co. Truffle Therapy Polishing Micro Exfoliating Truffle Face. Gosh. I guess it means like a exfoliator. Um, I'm gonna have to look up. I've never heard of this brand. I'm gonna have to look it up. I'm gonna have to look up this brand too. I have to look them both up. See if they're cruelty free. Cause I can't use them if they're not. Yes. Okay. So this month I did know that there was the thing you would either get a pretty vulgar concealer or a Too Faced highlighter, and I was like. I don't get Too Faced, hopefully I get the concealer. I did. And it is the Pretty Vulgar Undercover Concealer in Little White Lies. Ooh, I'm so excited. So that's the color. I'm gonna compare it to my other concealers. This one separates every time I just like let it chill. If it's just chilling, it separates. It's about the same color as the ColourPop one. Maybe like a shade more orangey. Like barely. See how close this is to shape group because this matches me perfectly. So it's a little, it's a lot darker than the shape tape. Um, yeah, we'll see. We'll try and make it work. And, uh, yeah, I'm excited to try it out. And have another full size concealer because I've been running on mostly a uh, little sample size. What's this? Avant Shea Butter Rice Brand Pantheol Age Radiance 8 Hour Radiance Renewal Sleeping Mask. Uh, I'm gonna have to look up this brand too. Never heard of it. Don't know if it's cruelty free. That's <laughs> three items that, uh, well, they'll either cruelty free and I'll keep them or uh, they're not and you'll get them. This last thing, oh, it's from Ace Beauté. It's the Vintage Dawn palette. Now, there's two palettes you could get. I don't remember which was which. I know there's a red one and then one with like blue and green and yellow and stuff. So hopefully I got like the blue and green and yellow one. But Vintage Dawn, I don't remember which one that is. I guess getting Scarlet, because it says 
The Vintage Dawn palette features 12 colors that are reminiscent of the beautiful sunrises witnessed in various locations around the world and is a sister palette to our Scarlet Dusk palette. Each color has been carefully milled and pressed to provide the easiest application and the most excellent color payoff. I'm guessing Scarlet Dusk is the red one, so I'm guessing this is probably like the green and blue and yellow one. Oh, I was right! Well, that green is a lot darker than I thought it was going to be. So it's mostly oranges. It's got this beautiful green, this blue, this blue, beautiful yellows. I love that orange. It's very bright. Okay, so I'm going to swatch two mattes, two metallics. I think I you definitely do. want to do Horizon, which is the orange. Or should I just swatch the whole thing? Screw it. We're going to swatch the whole thing. Screw it. Screw it. Sorry, I'm, I'm trying to use, like, adult language I'm comfortable with using on my channel because now the whole COPA laws are in place and I don't want to get in no trouble. So I want to make sure I'm saying things that are like, hey, I'm not condoning children watch me. It's up to their parents now. So the first row. So we have sun. Daybreak. Oh, that one's a little. Oh, then we have Horizon. That one's blue. I like that orange. And then we have Gleam. So it's pretty. It's pretty first row. Oh. Definitely very sunrisey, just like they said. Is mostly mats. There are five mats and and or no, there's seven mats and five shimmers. Okay, so next we have Grand Canyon. Accurate. Uh, then we have Golden Hour, which. For golden hour, I would have expected it to be more of a golden shade, but it's more of a bronzy shade. It's still pretty though. Pyramid. Not as accurate as Grand Canyon, but it's a pretty color. And then fade. Ooh, that's a nice like chocolate brown. The last row. Okay, so then we have Serengeti. That's beautiful. Cactus. Pretty nice. It's a little bit harder than the other ones. Color payoff yeah, is a little bit more difficult, but it could just be because I'm using my fingers. Something different when you use a brush. Then we have Sky. Oh, that's navy color. Beautiful. And then we have Dew. Oh, I love that. That's pretty. Oh, this palette though. This is really cute. Um, I really like it. Very excited. Um, my Ipsy, I know for sure, has two items that, uh, are gonna go straight to you guys because uh, I don't need more of what they are. Um, because my Ipsy does show everything. I get my hot. So let's see. Let's go through pricing. So the first thing is the Pretty Vulgar Undercover Concealer. It's twenty five dollars. Oh wait, but the Tarte Shape Tube is twenty eight. So I guess that's decent. The Ace Beauté Eyeshadow Palette is thirty four ninety nine. The Skin & Co. Roma Therapy Truffle Face Gommage is $28. That's not too bad. I thought it would be more. The Avant Skin Care 8 Hour Radiance Renewal Sleeping Mask is
I don't even want to say it. This little bottle is a hundred and seven dollars. Ooh, ooh! You don't believe me? I'll show you. It's too blurry, but it says a hundred and seven dollars. Oh, that's wild. That almost makes me not want to use it because, like, what if I like it? Then it's a hundred and seven dollars. Then we have the Mana Carter Beauty Lip Whip, which is $21. my skin a little bit I'm gonna try and press them in a little better oh this one too there we go okay so just be aware of that a little bit like uh yeah but that'll be it for this video um I'm still in shock over that one product but like whatever time it is wherever you are I hope it's great I hope it's grand and I will see you in my next video bye